Hello, chaps. I wanted to have a look at the uh, the Q Timex dive watch. Um, I kind of bought this on a whim, really. Uh, I didn't have a dive style watch, so uh, I saw some pictures online and thought this looks so cool. That retro charm, I think it is an absolute beauty. So I kind of bought it on a whim and wasn't sure, but this has grown to be one of my favourite watches. I just absolutely love the way this looks. I think it's fantastic. Uh, look at that strap. It's excellent. This is a really stylish, funky, retro watch. Um, absolute beauty. It's become, like I say, one of my favourites. I wear this one all the time. It's got 50 metres water resistance. Uh, so, you know, you wouldn't want to use this as a real dive watch or anything, but it'll survive splashes. I have worn it in the shower to test it and it, it's been fine with that. I would probably not hesitate to go swimming in a swimming pool with it. I might take it on holiday with me when I go. It just looks so nice. We've got this uh, bi-directional bezel with no clicks, but you know, I use this as a timer. I'm gonna time my cup of tea to brew for five minutes for proper richness and flavor. Very useful for things like that. The crystal is just acrylic, so that is gonna scratch to buggery. Um, I don't think you can see any scratches on the camera here. It has got some small micro scratches on it. It's gonna pick up scratches really easily. I mean, those can be buffed out. It's about 44 millimeters lug to lug. So it's a really nice size. I have an approximately seven inch wrist uh, and I think that sits absolutely perfectly. Really, really nice. A lot of uh, modern dive watches and modern watches in general uh, just too big. I'm used to wearing smaller watches. I think this is a perfect size for a seven inch wrist. I think it goes with almost any outfit. This is a fabulous little watch. I don't know what they're priced at now. I got this on set time at sale. I think I paid about a hundred quid for it. Well worth it. Very, very nice watch. A lot of reviews go into minute detail in the specs. I'm not going to, I just wanted to do a quick chat about this. It's a winner. The strap, as you can see, my arms are fairly hair suit. Uh, I don't really have any major issues with it pulling my arm hairs. Uh, you know, if it does, that's just tough, isn't it? It's worth the pain, man. Love this watch. Highly recommended. Thank you for watching. Bye.